expanding mass health coverage. 22 News State House reporter Alicia Machado is live in Boston with what lawmakers are doing to ensure that residents can get dental care. Many of the state's low-income residents don't have access to dental care, but lawmakers are pushing to provide them with full coverage through Mass Health under a state proposal. You might think a simple toothache isn't a big deal, but without proper care, it could send you to the emergency room. If you have not the money to pay for it, the last thing you're going to want to do is pay for a dentist. Senate Majority Leader Harriet Chandler told 22 News doctors will prescribe pain medication to ease a toothache, but it doesn't solve the problem and can lead to bigger issues like addiction. Pain medicine, we now know, can be very addictive. We're not only not curing the problem, but we're building ourselves into an addiction problem. Many people who are on mass health cannot afford to pay for dental care, a service that the state used to cover. South Hadley State Representative John Seibeck filed a bill that would restore oral health benefits for mass health recipients. The proposal could face issues getting funding from the state at a time when lawmakers face budget difficulties. But Representative Seibeck told 22 News if the state doesn't fund dental coverage now, taxpayers will have to pick up the bill in the long run. Providing full coverage for dental care, we may actually forestall and, and prevent some of the uh, more expensive costs if that person ultimately sees those those medical problems and those medical complications. The bill is currently under review by the state's public health committee. The public can give their input on the bill at a hearing before the state's public health committee here at the state house. Live in Boston, Alicia Machado for 22 News.